What up guys, James here, aka The Pomp, and yes, it's late, it's weird to be filming this late, but really excited for this, and it's actually never too late to go ahead and finally announce the release date for the Bass Pomade. So Clay and I have been working on this one for a long time now, we've been working it since mid-February, bunch of different revisions, bunch of different changes to the many aspects of this pomade. And so we've worked really hard for it, and we're finally releasing it this weekend. It's going to drop on Saturday, May 16th at 8 a.m. Pacific time. I chose this time because it's a pretty standard drop time for a lot of like clothing, styling things, Supreme, but stuff like that. So I want to go ahead and get used to this sort of weird like 8 a.m. morning drop time since many of you guys might be already accustomed to it. But I wanted to go with that. Saturday is a good date. But either way, I wanted to finally unleash it, reveal it, open it, pass it on to you guys. And yes, this is actually really exciting for me and Clayton because honestly, on my side, this is probably the best pomade I will ever release with a collaboration. And this one is actually a big deal for me. And it's like a big step uh, in terms of what I took for like the name and stuff like that because I've had this idea for a while now, but it's actually finally this time that I decided to make this move, make this step forward and go ahead and put out a product that's actually named the base pomade. Because the base, the word base, it's more than just like an internet meme. It's more than just like an internet gif. Yes, it's coined by Lil B, like the base guy and stuff like that. But the concept, the meaning of it is like something truly wholesome and stuff like that. And so there's a lot of power to the word and there's a lot of oomph that I wanted to like carry through with this pomade. Because this pomade is not just something me and Clayton just wanted to make that was like good. We, that wasn't our only goal. This, the base pomade is like truly a statement to the pomade community. It's basically saying a mixture of base in the meaning of little B, but also base in terms of like water base, oil base, wax base, all that bullshit that everyone is obsessed with. Because like the old dude's water base, the base pomade is confusing. It's water-based by technicality, but it doesn't embody the standard like water-based characteristics we assume, we preconceive for many of the water-based like gel pomades that uh, currently exist on the market. And instead, it makes use of this like terminology that's just a technicality. And by using it, it also embodies a lot of what we typically are associating or we typically associate with like oil-based pomades. And so it, it's a mixture of both, yet it's like really neither of them. And so the base is kind of like a play, a satire on our obsession with oil base versus water base. And also along with that, Lil B Base God, it's a shout out to this idea of just doing your thing, just like fuck the noise, just do your role and like just do what like feels natural to you and just like shut out everything else and just do what you're good at. And so the base pomade is essentially just shutting out the world and really emphasizing what I have to offer and what Clayton has to offer and really showing like the market that there are these categories that exist that really constrain what we can make and these preconceived condition, uh, tra traditions, this idea of like classicism and like just all these, all these very like minute details are very unnecessary clicks that exist in the pomade community that really like restrict what we can, what the home brewer connoisseurs and what the community as a whole can offer itself. And so like I said, base pomade is actually more of a statement to the pomade community. And of course, in order to make a statement, it is what I believe to be one of the best products Clayton and I have ever like made, touch or whatever really. Because it's not just a water-based like, formula, it actually is change. And it's changed in a really interesting way, in a way that allows one scoop, loose pompadour, two scoops, a nice clean light pompadour, and then three scoops, it's, it works a lot like the pomade. Going back to our like oil base, our first collab with like Edwin, Clayton, and I. And so it's a big deal. And also the scent, the scent we, ooh, we had so many damn revisions. I can't tell you how many of these little like glass tubes that Clayton sent me to go um, like revise and stuff like that because as you guys remember, I always tried this like cologne type of smell and this cologne smell, yes, we've like reached it some point, but 
a true cologne, a $300, $400, $500 cologne can never truly be replicated. It's extremely complex, multidimensional, and it, it costs a lot for a reason. Like when you smell it, like it brings you up, down, to, fro, right, left. It takes like your senses for a ride. And our pomades, they can't really replicate that. It's a really similar smell, but it's a single tone smell. It, it's just like a, it's a note that mocks the sound, but it just, it's really just super simple and I can't really truly copy what a like a high-end cologne can do and so I thought about it for a long time decide whether I really wanted to try to hit that or not and I was just like this is the point in time the base pomade is the point in time for us to stop trying to be something we're not and so instead what the base pomade provides is a nice baseline in order for you to put on your cologne that will be the rest of like the tune, that will be the rest of the notes. But this pomade acts as the baseline. It's a simple, nice scent that can accent, support, accommodate, add on to any other clone you're using. And even if you use it in isolation, it's a nice, clean scent that's not super noisy, that does not take over you and your image, but just a sense, or accents, my bad, but also just really supports your image, whatever it is, it's highly versatile, and that's what I meant it to be. And also, really stays loyal to that herbalness that we associate with like old dudes products. And while well, this video is going a lot long, I just got obsessed and got caught up in telling you guys about the baseball mate. It was actually just supposed to be a release, a date thing, but yeah, I mean, okay, let's wrap it up. The baseball mate being released this Saturday, 8 a.m. Pacific time on the old dudes website, not just Etsy's old dudes website. And of course, the promo code's not gonna apply. No, that should be a given. But yes, this Saturday, 8 a.m. Pacific time, Old Dude's website, be there. I'll also be releasing another video to go ahead and boom, open the doors and BS like that. But yes, all right, good night, guys. Hope you guys are informed now. Really excited for this weekend, so peace out. Thank you, Base Pump.